We're back again with another episode of Fun Tech Facts where we tell you fun facts about tech that you may find interesting or even surprising. Today's fun facts is related to that one thing you can't live without, your phone. But before we begin, this video is brought to you by Good Deals by KLGG, our official e-store where you can get all kinds of awesome gadgets. You can even enjoy 0% installment payment with IOU Pay when you use your credit or debit card for any product that is priced 100 ringgit and above. Visit the link below for more information. Now, this is a fun fact about my favorite phone brand, Apple. Did you know before the iPhone concept came about, Apple was actually working on the tablet? I actually started on the tablet first. The late Steve Jobs revealed during the 2010 D8 conference that the company was developing a tablet and wanted a glass multi-touch display. It took the employees six months, but they came back with a successful prototype display that also supported inertial scrolling. And I put the tablet project on the shelf because the phone was more important. And we went and took the next several years and did the iPhone. And when we got our, when we got our wind back, and uh, thought we could take on something next. Pulled the tablet off the shelf, took everything we learned from the phone, and went back to work on the tablet. This led Steve Jobs to the idea of creating a smartphone and prioritizing the iPhone over the tablet that we came to know later on as the iPad. And that's how the iPhone was born. But keep in mind that the iPad kind of came first. Finland has mobile phone throwing championships? Yes, you read that right. Mobile phone throwing is an international sport that started in Finland back in the year 2000. You literally compete by throwing your phones away and get judged on your techniques and the distance thrown. Now you're probably thinking, why would you throw your phone away just like that? Isn't that dumb? That's what I thought too. But this actually started because back then, old phones were being thrown away instead of being recycled, causing pollution. So to solve this problem, an insurance company actually sponsored this mobile phone throwing event to encourage the recycling of old, unused mobile phones. Also, participants can choose any phone they like as long as it's within 220 grams to 400 grams. I'm pretty sure most of our smartphones now weigh less than that, and even if they don't, I am also sure that none of us will be willing to yeet them off like that. Conclusion, mobile phone throwing competitions, count me out. Nomophobia. What the heck is that? If you don't need me to explain this term to you, chances are you have already googled this because you most probably are nomophobic. Nomophobia is the fear of being away from your phone or disconnected from it. So for example, if your phone is running out of battery or if you misplace it and couldn't find it immediately, you get really anxious. If we break it down, nomophobia stands for no mobile phone phobia. So in an Australian study conducted over 2,700 smartphone users this year, 99% of them have nomophobia to a certain degree. In another report, it was revealed that the average time spent on phone has increased to 4.2 hours a day, which is a 30% increase compared to two years back. So if you realize that you've been spending too much time on your phone, you may want to cut it down so you don't become nomophobic like me. And that's the end of today's episode of Fun Tech Facts. If you find this video interesting or even helpful, share it with your friends and families and give it a thumbs up. Remember to subscribe to our channel, KL Gadget TV, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.